we speak to mountains our god is greater our god is stronger we speak to mountains our fate is wider our fate is bigger we speak to mountains today we speak to our mountains our faith in god can move our mountains today he said and jesus said unto them because of your unbelief for really i say unto you if you have faith as grain as a mustard seed you shall say unto this mountain be hence to yonder place and it shall remove nothing shall be impossible unto you today we have that assurance that when we say be removed and be cast into the sea and don't doubt in our heart god will move on our behalf we speak to our mountains and faith today each of us may have a mountain in our life whether it's unemployment financial problems difficult marriage illness undefeated sin whatever it is we have the power in us to speak to that mountain and say be thou removed we have the authority to say be thou removed in the name of Jesus we have the authority to speak to that mountain as righteous children of God we have that faith we have faith in God and we can walk in faith today and speak to our mountain Prayer can change things. Worship can change things. Your faith can move mountains today. We serve the great I am, an awesome God who's well able to do great things. He's the God that answers by fire. And mountains are moved when we pray and believe in our hearts. When we move in that mustard seed of faith, our mountains will be moved so we have that faith today it's only for us to grab a hold of the promises of God put our trust in him for we walk by faith and not by sight so we speak to our mountains today and we say be thou removed and cast into the sea Today, I decree and declare that we shall have that mustard seed of faith to speak to our mountains. I decree and declare that we are set free. And whom the sun sets free is free indeed. We will not put our trust in man. We will not put our trust in flesh we will put our trust in God we will live by faith and not by sight we will walk by faith I decree and declare that whatever decision we make today we will speak to our mountains in the name of Jesus we choose life today we choose blessings today we choose the word of god today we choose wisdom today and we speak to our mountains i decree and declare that you have faith to speak to your mountains and they will obey i decree and declare that you shall not be shaken you shall not be moved for your God is faithful 
and his promises is true. It is time to speak to our mountains in our life. It is time for them to be removed in the name of Jesus. Oh, Rabba Sheke and I decree and declare that you have prosperity and good success because of God's grace in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Right now, I speak to every mountain in your life. And I command it to be removed and cast into the sea according to Mark 11, 23 in the name of Jesus. I speak to every financial mountain. I say, be thou removed from your life in the name of Jesus. I speak to every mountain of sickness. I speak to every mountain of lack. I decree and declare that it shall not be your portion. I speak to every mountain of sickness in the name of Jesus. Sickness and disease is not your portion today in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare that sickness shall be far from you. I speak to every mountain that is causing you to be upset causing you to not sleep in the name of Jesus I decree and declare that every mountain will hear the voice of the Lord and be thou removed in the name of Jesus I speak to the mountains and I command them to hear the word of the Lord and be removed according to Ezekiel chapter 36 verse 4 oh Rabba Sheke and Therefore, O mountains of Israel, hear the word of the Lord. Thus says the Lord God to mountains, the hills, the rivers, the valleys, the desolate ways, and the cities that have been forsaken, which become plunder and mockery to the rest of the nation. So we speak to those mountains today. And declare that they will hear the word of God in the name of Jesus. Father God, you are against every destroying mountain, according to Jeremiah 51 25. So, Father God, we speak to every mountain in our life. We say that it will be gone, it will be removed, it will be cast into the sea in the name of Jesus. Father God, let every mountain melt at your presence, O God. Every mountain in our way today will become plain, according to Zechariah 4, verse 7. Father God, we trash every mountain. We beat it up, O God. With the power and the authority, O God. Our faith in you, O oh God. The prayer of faith is a bold prayer. So we speak to our mountains in faith, knowing that you are well able to move on our behalf. We thank you that you can take every impossible circumstances and walk it out for your glory oh god so whatever mountain we are faced today we thank you that no sickness no obstacle no poverty no broken relationship not as nothing is too hard for you to overcome oh god We have the authority today, so we speak to our mountains. We thank you that nothing will separate us from you today. I honor you and I glorify you, O God. And with the authority that you have given unto me, O God, that you have given unto us, we speak to our mountains today in the name of Jesus. We speak to every obstacle in the name of Jesus. He said, be thou removed and be cast into the sea. Our faith in you, O God, can move our mountains. So we thank you that we are walking in faith today 
and we are taking authority to speak to our mountains. Oh, Rabba Sheke and Every mountain must bow at your name. We speak Jesus to every mountain. We speak Jesus to every mountain. We speak Jesus to every mountain. Our faith in you can move mountains. So we muster up that seed of faith today in the mighty name of Jesus. And we speak to our mountains. Thank you, mighty God.